Ah, well, we last left off. We got Rose's radio up and running. Let me just grab my stuff. Now we need to go clear out the, uh, I forget the name of it. Clear out the lower section of top of the tower. Alright, we've cleared this out before for fun when we we're trying to figure out what to do with this tower. So it shouldn't be too hard this time around. I kind of needed that shotgun. This thing's doing all right for now. We'll have to find a workbench in a minute and uh, repair the shotgun or find something better to use. Alright, so we've repaired the shotgun and we've still got ammo in this night vision thing. Uh, maybe, maybe a shotgun isn't the best thing for this distance. Man, I love this gun. Oh, I'm gonna be so sad when this thing is like out of level. I think we've almost cleared them all out. What's with these ones, eh? They just stand here. He's not even gonna react. Weird. I just had to leave after clearing it and come back. The hell is this? Where's Thorp? You got that old diaper pail on your side. So the hell are you? Tell me you're one of those worthless settlers. Holy shit, a vault dweller! Even better. You come scurrying out of your little cubby hole and you think you can start making demands? Think again. David's trophy, huh? Wow, he must be dead. Or turn tail if you've managed to get your hands on it. Huh. I take it this means you recognize me as leader around here. Hmm, smart. Looks like you've got yourself a brain after all. Seeing as how I'm feeling generous, I'll spare you a minute to tell me what you want before I get back to retaking Appalachia. Uh-uh, you don't get to talk to me about that. We lost everything to that disease while you were all sitting pretty underground. Inoculation? That's just some bullshit the responders made up to sucker the weak out of their supplies. Didn't fall for it then? Sure as shit ain't falling for it now. Efficacy, huh? <laughs> Maybe you do know what you're talking about, but I don't know. I got my own straight line solution. Kill them all. Got a raid against a group of Scorch going down right now. Why don't you head on over? See a real plan in action. Oh, I'll take that bet. Head out to their location. Once you got it all wrapped up, head back to our base. It's the crater. Built out of that old space station? 
Believe me, you can't miss it. Cool, so that's uh that's the later of the raiders, huh? To pay those settlers a visit. Can't let them miss me too much. Nah, see, I know you're just trying to make me shoot you. And now that we're done with Top of the World, there's not much else to really do around there. So I decided let's go to Morganstown and figure out this nuke shine mystery. Oh yeah, Morganstown's mostly filled with gore, but it's kind of like the uh, zombie town. Ooh, that's where this shotgun is gonna shine. Man, this part of the town reminds me of The Walking Dead so much. Enough of that, it's probably another copyright strike. Man, all these things always have useless stuff on them, like cat balls and shit. Alright, I don't know what's funny the teddy bear on the toilet reading the newspaper, or the one that clearly died having a shit. Uh, we got more. This also looks like some sort of medical tent. I thought I had a nade. I don't have a nade. Oh, I did, of course, I pick up one. And they all start rushing. Oh, I think I remember this place. All the weird outfits and that you can choose from. The alcohol and food. Purified water, nice, we'll take that. Ugh, we shouldn't take the alcohol, we're already addicted to that. Uh, I don't really want a magnifying glass. Let's, I'll probably break it down, try to make a scope out of it or something. Cap stash and caps. Toilet paper. You know, I never really thought about it, but you never really use the toilet in full out. I'm like, I'm not expecting this to be like scum where you squat and have a shit, but. Still. Wrapped cap. You know, I might want to see what that looks like. Oh! Oh, where did you come from? Oh yeah, so the other day, because of my um, Fallout-related content, uh, TikTok and YouTube recommended me some facts about nuclear fallout. Like, actual nuclear fallout. Some of it was pretty fucking scary. Like, uh, some people that were just outside the blast radius actually had their skin burnt. Like, how you would see these ghouls and Scorch, like, full-on their skin would peel off when they were trying to rescue them. Horrible shit. And, um... Other ones would be blinded with like a permanent picture in their eye of the uh, the nuclear explosion. That's crazy. Nukes are scary shit. Okay, so this is part of the riddle. This is the statue they're talking about. It has to be, right? Yeah, it stands a cold grey. So... They couldn't possibly be talking about inside, right? I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't expecting robots, I was expecting a lot more ghouls. Yeah, 
God damn, the shotgun is not as effective against uh, robots. Yeah, that's what I thought. It doesn't really give you, like, where it is. It just gives you a vague radius and a riddle. We will figure this out, though. Commencing. Oh, that's how you take these things out easily. You shoot their arms off. I don't really know how to take these things out easy though, they're just a big ball, where's the weak point? Nice, some boiled water. Oh, we only got four shells left, that's not good. Man, I love the detail on the walls here, this shit looks like scary Japanese uh, haunted house type thing. If you've ever seen what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. God damn, I love this gun. I kind of wish I had the schematic for it, and the schematic for the scope. The blade in front of it, I mean like, this gun goes for a lot of range, it's steady as hell to shoot, a lot of damage. And then close quarters we got that knife. It's a good gun. Yeah, hold it tape. Oh, it's kind of a short hollow tape. I don't, I don't think we're really going to find what we're looking for in this building somehow, so... Yeah, let's just clear these out and we'll move on. <laughs> he landed on his head. I thought it was night time for a second there. I was about to say, how long have we been in there for? For some reason, the sun had to load in. Okay, back to the riddle. This is the statue. The cold grey boy, the steps behind him at the threshold, the first threshold. In the corner, study the street just to the left is the place that we meet. There you can stain your skin, find the back door, and we'll get you a drink. Okay, so that kind of sounds like a library, a tattoo parlor, and you can stain your skin. Around the back, you can get a drink. Are we looking for a tattoo parlor with a pub, or...? I don't know. 
Ooh, it's dark in here. Oh, I hear more footsteps. Okay, well, thanks for making me poop my pants. Alright, perhaps we should go back um, to the statue. Alright, so maybe I was looking at it backwards. Maybe we need to face the way the statue went and follow them stairs and go down the street. I gotta say, this isn't looking hopeful. Yeah, there's no signs back here to tell you what any of this is. Maybe we're just gonna keep going down the street. Round the corner. Study the street. Study the street? Or study there? I don't know, I'm pretty sure they mean like study the street, but I took that as a library because I'm stupid. Nice, take some 38 rounds. I don't know what we have that uses that, but I'll take it. Oh, hello there. Whatever. Oh, there's more. Man, this thing's gonna be good even when it's out of ammo. Get one of these guns, trust me, just just go get one of these guns. Alright, let's try this street, what do we got here? Bust up. <clears throat> What's this place? A bank, okay. Isn't this the place we were just in like 10 minutes ago? It is the same goddamn place. This riddle, you know, drive me insane, and I'm not gonna look it up. I'm gonna solve it myself. I don't want to look it up. What's the fun of that? All right, so back at the statue. Beyond the stairs, the first threshold. Is he talking about that? We go around this corner, and then to this street. He might very well be talking about that. There's a bar. <clears throat> so that's where we can get a drink. Get a quick scoop, noob. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah, right, so surely this would have to be. Uh, this is the street for the uh, move. How many of them are there? Just, just die. Go away. I'm trying to do something. Let me think. What's this? Tattoo parlor. Stain your, stain your skin. Yeah. So around the back. I think we found it. Is that a hard hat? Okay, let's go in. You hear like a... Moonshine distillery or something? Oh, that or a science experiment? What the fuck is that? Okay, so... This doesn't make sense. This is the tattoo parlor. She said, go around the back. And that's all we meant. You heard that, right? Hello, disembodied voice? Okay, I don't know what that was. I'll get a working terminal. Let's uh, let's investigate this. Big house advertisement draft. Okay, nothing useful. A memo. Okay, this was pointless. 
Okay, we've come this far. We're in the tattoo parlor. My ambibulation chamber is feeling... It, it's feeling empty. Or is that my combobulating unit? This is where it sounds... It's a door. It was a door. Look at this place. This is kind of cool. Okay, I guess follow the sounds of moonshine distilling. I knew it. Uh, excuse me there. I could, I could, you know, really use a hand. And you got more than just the one. Hi, I'm Bev. And Bev Ridge is the number one alcohol quality testing robo brain. And all I'm about to do, I've been abstaining. Well, happy late, ya! Well, this is your choice premier drink, Nuka Shine! Now, would you be a doll and whip me up a batch of Nuka Shine so I can do my job, please? I do have the recipe right here, but. I think I might have sort of kind of dropped part of it in the lock supply room. Don't be me! Okay, I'm ready to receive it. Give it. Mm. This My tough. friends are. They are great. Especially that lovely little brick over there. Bro, I'm starting to feel really uncomfortable. Can you just give me the fucking thing? Did you already give it to us? <laughs> you already gave it to us. What the fuck am I standing here for? A one, a two, a one, two, fuck you. <laughs> one for the money, two for the show. Three to get ready and go, go, go. <laughs> Don't you step on my fucking shoes. <laughs> What's this? That's random. Um, I figure we should return to where we got the nuke shine from in the first place. Maybe there's something there we could use. Can I get up please? Stop fucking with me. Okay, we didn't really get too much of a chance to explore this place last time. Was this here last time? Hmm. I don't think it was. You definitely weren't here last Friendly time. Friendly reminder for game Tuesdays. And what's with no this red ramp? Matter. Nice first try. Medics. You can call a bottle. Huh. We got hit. Whoa, this dude was a serious Nuka Cola fan. Yeah, he left some caps behind. And a holo tape. Personal log. Timestamp 1120. Nuka Cola lamp arrived in satisfactory condition. After a few modifications, I am greatly pleased. I clearly now have the greatest Nuka Cola collection in the city, but I've pushed the capacity of this meager hovel to the limit. Solution I need to procure a warehouse in Morgantown for further expansion, but first, I need the proper financial capital. I clearly need to strategize a successful commercial enterprise. University students are plentiful, but what do they want? Aha! Proposal Students love alcohol, and I love Nuka Cola. I shall formulate a high-proof distilled spirit with Nuka-Cola, the perfect beverage. Hmm. It just needs a name. The furnace. Nuka the Hall. Still must Nuka, be Nuka Mash. Nuka Brew. Uh, I'll get to that part later. In order to produce moonshine. Okay, that was kind of cool. 
not what we were really looking for, but it's still kind of cool. This has got to be it. Alright, that was it. Password added. Let's go back. Ah, we're in. Let's get the rest of this uh, recipe. Oh. Nuclear material, ironically, in this room. Ah, let me gather up the whole recipe that we need, and then um, we'll come back here. Excuse if you can hear traffic behind me. This this car is coming through here in the house. Uh, so on the map it looks like there's a little farm out here, we can get like, the uh, razor grain. Hold up. Why are you running? Ah, oh, well that was weird, but yeah, like I was saying, there's a little farm out here that you can get razor grain, um, the corn, there's that. Fuck, what was wrong with that one? This stone looks pretty sick. Ah, uh, so the farm is just across this. Alright, let's gather everything we need. Alright, so we still need one Nuka-Cola Quantum. And boiled water. Boiled water is easy, we can just do that at our camp, but... I don't know where we're going to get another Quantum from. Whoa, what about War Frenzy? <laughs> Yeah, because if you remember, we got a quantum um, first time we came to that house, but we accidentally used it um, when we went to that robot city. I mean, we really needed the health from the um, blood eagles that were chasing us. Did someone set up like this whole little pathway? They go from building to building so they don't have to touch the floor with the ghouls. It kind of seems like that. Let's see, let's go to the roof. Ah, hello. Oh, look at you. Now you look 100%, it's to avoid the ghouls. Look. Let's get this stuff, but there's a whole pathway here. Looks like this used to be a monorail. I reckon I can climb up that. I don't know if I can get back on the track now. This was probably a stupid idea. I'm also over encumbered. I need to get back to like a camp or something or a scrap table. Combat armor helmet. That's kind of cool. What's that look like? Oh yeah, that's that's more my style. I like that. I think we can jump back to the track from here. Yeah. Oh, there's even a plank to walk across. Yeah, this looks like it's full on built um, to keep people off the road. Got some food. I was hoping for a nuke shine, but I'll take this. If we can't end up finding a uh, nuke shine, we have another mission to do in here for now until we find one. Um, 
I think it was visit the Morganstown High School. Yeah. <laughs> this man has got blind drunk during his last moments before the explosion. <laughs> I think this is end of the line. <laughs> I don't have enough AP to hit it. God damn it. I hate being over encumbered. Yeah, this is where the tracks end. No nuke shine. Ah, it's finally daytime. I decided to come down to the airport and there's an event to do here. If you remember we did this before with that guy who had the power armor and the minigun, but I think we're gonna try to do it alone. Message. Radar has spotted an inbound cargo bot. We've got to secure the landing zone so we can make the drop. We need those supplies, but the cargo bot's going to attract attention, so get ready for a fight. Alright, here they come. Man, we have limited ammo. I probably should have thought about this. I didn't even take him out. Alright, we're just gonna have to use all the ammo we've got. Nice, more shotgun ammo. Keep us afloat. We've also got this thing. Um, man, we're screwed. Let me see if I can hit that with Syringer. Isn't that what uh, Rose said to do? Hit something strong? Never mind that. Oh, god damn. Please tell me this isn't the only thing I have ammo in. Oh, we got six shots in this thing. I don't know how well that's gonna do. Man, neighbor's dog going off at some. Oh, that's, that's it, hardly anything. I can't do this with a syringe. Come on. Don't hit me for a second. I'm looking for something. Please leave me alone. We're gonna hit him with this thing still. But even that's not really that good. Get off me. I haven't got the AP to run. I haven't got the AP to hit either. Oh my god, leave me alone for a minute so I can look in my inventory. I really miss when Fallout used to pause the world and use your pit boy. But that's not an option anymore, so let's just keep running. Nowhere to go, we're just gonna have to stand and kill him. Oh, he dropped something. Give me that ammo. What's that for? We had a hatchet this whole time? Hell yeah. Let's cut him up. That's way more effective. Where'd the other one go? Did this thing start with blood on it or am I getting blood on it? Either way, it looks sick. Can you stop? Are you fucking with me? Fire axe. Bigger hatchet. Alright, let's test. This thing's clean. When we hit someone with it, will they get blood on it? Ah, here they come. I'm walking slowly. It does get blood on it, that's sick. Uh, we 
think you think you're gonna out ask me? This one's come on with a shank. Fuck off. Was better, big axe or little axe? Little axe felt quicker. Did tiny bit less damage. Big axe did big damage. Slower though. We got some legendaries coming in. What is that thing he's got? Hold up. Yeah. Now we can fight without getting shot at. <coughs> what was that? Can this bag get out of my face? I'm trying to hit people. A fat man. Oh, a fat man. Hold up. I definitely want to use that thing before the end of the day. That's sick. In fact, fat man, fat man, fat man, fat man. We got one shot with it. Let's make it count. Ooh, that was sick. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Fuck off. I don't even notice he didn't get blasted. Anybody? Oh. Yeah. Only a few left. This is wave 5 of 5, this should be it, yeah. Attention responders! Cargo bot is now on final approach. Eyes to the sky, people! Okay, so now what, we just wait for this thing to come and drop off our package? Okay. Here comes the Domino's drone. Man, one day Amazon's probably gonna be like this. Probably won't drop it to the floor, but I'm probably like fly down, gently drop it, release. People throwing rocks at it and shit. <laughs> you know, good times. Uh, now that we earned a care package, let's move out. We will eventually get to the Morgantown High School, but I noticed this prison on the map. Alright, let's get in there. I mean, after shooting at you, so I just have to run. I'm gonna make it to the door. Alright, get off me, hedges. No, oh, fuck you. To be continued. Will I survive? <laughs> <laughs> 